Welcome to Painting Workshops 2, which is a collection of four still life painting projects. And this is a great introduction to painting still lifes from life. Hi, I'm Richard Robinson. In this first lesson called The Pair, I'm going to show you how to set up a still life in your studio, how to see light and shadow very clearly, how to overcome the tricks that your eyes will play on you. We'll start off with a simple grayscale study. We will learn about painting form with light and shade families. Next we'll move on to a colour study where we'll learn about matching colour and lost and found edges. In the last project we'll do four 10 minute studies to start honing the skills that we've learned. In the next workshop called the white jug I'm going to show you how to arrange an interesting still life composition. How to transfer your design to the canvas with an accurate drawing. How to start by blocking in the big shapes first. How to create believable three dimensional form. How to paint a realistic grape. And those finishing touches. So you can either follow me step by step or design your own still life painting. Either way, by the end of this lesson you're going to have a beautiful still life painting and feel confident to tackle your next one. In the third workshop I'm going to show you how I set up my palette for a still life painting, how painting on a toned canvas can help you, the best way to capture vibrant color in a painting, seeing and painting white objects that aren't actually white, how just a few details can add realism to your painting and how grey colour is so important in creating the impression of vibrant colour. In the final still life workshop I'm going to show you how to start a painting with masses rather than lines which is a really nice fluid way to paint and you'll be adjusting the drawing as you go. We'll cover the fine art of painting glass and mirrored surfaces which are both quite tricky and I'll show you how to create a painting that glows with colour and the make and break technique for beautiful highlights. By the end of this lesson you'll have the ability to tackle any still life with confidence. Learn by comparing your work with other students work and by reading my personal critiques. This is a great way to improve your painting quickly. You'll find that my method of painting is very fast and fluid, but the way I teach is nice and slow. So you'll find it a joy to paint quickly and confidently following this lesson step by step, just like thousands of my students are all over the world. So happy painting, let's get started. Mm -hmm.